Hey, out there, how you doing? As the title says, it's my birthday this week, so come celebrate. I'm gonna play some Tomb Raider today. I'm going away this weekend to celebrate my birthday, so I won't be here Friday and Saturday, but I'll be here uh, for a special stream tomorrow. So I got today and tomorrow for Tomb Raider. Just to recap, I'm about 10 hours in, and I'm at this place where we've, we got an escape boat. It's just not working real well. And uh, thank you, Arthur, and happy Wednesday to you, too. So we got an escape boat. We got everybody corralled. All the good guys are here on the beach, but we can't get out of here yet. So I've been asked to go up this way to try and figure out a way to get us off the boat. Thank you, Jordo, and happy Wednesday to you. I got this new bow. It is deadly. Loving it. Hey, thank you for subscribing, Lobo. Phantasma, great username. Uh-oh, what's the bell mean? Did I forget something? I think that was just because I looted that animal. Anyway, I hope you're having a fantastic day. I am doing good. I'm excited about taking the camper out this weekend. We're gonna go to a secret location off the coast of California. Should be pretty cool. Shoot rope arrows at craggy rocks to create rope lines. So, is that a craggy rock? Yep. The, the music's getting a little insane right now already, so I think this is gonna be an exciting moment. I gotta get warmed up. I haven't played this since Saturday. It's really not that long. Reach the Endurance Wreck. Okay, so we need something off from the Endurance, which is the boat that we originally came in and shipwrecked. Ah, uh, Arthur, I wish you were here to celebrate too. Jordo, I'm getting old. I'll just say that. Buster, hello. How you doing? Did you find the terminal cover you were looking for? Okay, Reyes, I'm getting close to the endurance. What do you need exactly? Alex, we were getting worried. I'm gonna need a breaker bar and the rest of my kit. I can't fix this boat without them. All right, I'm on it. Lara is heading your way. You should wait for her. Lara? No, no, I got this. Mm. I'm heading in. What's Go Alex doing? Silent. <laughs> Laura and I have the same question. What is Alex up to? So I'm going to start on the low route here and see what I can get. What did I what did I miss out on? Okay, I missed the upper. So, let's see. Just take a quick look around and there's something here. Good deal. Awesome. Yes, PayPal is your friend. You know, I used to work for them a long time ago. Hey, neighbor Pavel, how you doing? Thank you very much. Jordan's going to Japan. Awesome. Set. I'll research it if I ever get out of this place. Oh, a jade headrest. It doesn't look real comfortable, but okay. Uh, Jordo, I'm jealous. I've flown through Japan before, but I've never stopped and actually done anything there. That sounds like a treat. Okay, it doesn't look like I can get out of here this way, so I'm gonna go back. Mm, wait a second, wait a second. The unknown noob, good afternoon to you too. Hope you're living the life fantastic. I wonder, can I just do this? Yeah, yeah, of course Laura can do that. So many options here, I'm not quite sure what to do. Queen, thank you very much. Have I ever had, I think it's pronounced mochi? Yes, I have. Very, very good stuff. Hey, Alan, thank you very much. I appreciate it very, very much. Getting older is more fun when you have friends to celebrate with. My day's been grand, no complaints. 
Alright, this kind of looks like a waste of time over here. I don't see anything. Well, maybe. Can I, like, slip down here? Is this something? Yeah, I don't know what this is for. Alright, upward and onwards, then. This is just a mess of things. Whoa, 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 whoa. Easy, Lara. Thank you, Arthur. You too. You too. Absolutely. Oh, where's this gonna go? Oh. Alright. Well... That is tempting. That's kind of telling me I should go there for some reason. Enigma! Hey, dude! Oh, sweet! Upgrade for the rifle. Just what I wanted. That's just what I wanted. Jordo, your dad loves this game. I'm loving it too. Actually, Enigma, who just jumped into chat, was the one who recommended it, and I'm very, very thankful. It has turned out to be a thrilling game with great graphics. Gameplay is nearly perfect. Here, there seems to be so much. Aha. Yep, I see you. GPS cache. Ding, ding. Ah, uh, the first one, Buster. Good memory, dude. Very good memory. Yeah, <laughs> and that too. Mentally. <laughs> Mentally, I'm right there. You're gonna play Rise next? Is that the next one in the series, Enigma? I wanna say I remember you saying that might be the next one to play. I think I'll get there. I got some other games on tap that I wanna play. Speaking of other games, I was just reading about the news about Max Payne's uh, remake, and I'm extremely excited for it. I love the original Max Payne 1 and 2. I haven't played 3, but I heard that uh, Remedy and Rockstar are going to work together to remake Max Payne, but they're going to, instead of doing like Max Payne 1 definitive or whatever, and Max Payne 2, they're going to do Max Payne 1 and 2. Buster, are you 61? Okay, so Rise is next, and then Shadow is probably not worth it. Uh, there is a pretty bad Max Payne film. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I need to wait here, because... I know, I know. I considered buying them on PC. You gotta take it. Sorry. What the? Whoa. I thought that was a headshot for sure, but... Oof. Right by its head. The new bow's got some distance on it, but I don't know. Let's see if I can hit this guy. trouble. That was a mistake. Uh oh. My bad, Buster. I am mixing you up with someone else then. Haven't thought about it. I don't really think about that too much. Alright, these guys are... No offense. I've never also never seen you, so I don't... I don't know. Ah, these guys are with firebombs. Oh, that's more than a firebomb. But yeah, I was considering buying Max Payne 1 and 2 on PC because I think they're a little bit better because they're 
Whoa. You're gonna die. You're wrong. Time to die. I'm not wasting any ammo on you. They're like, you can get the whole collection for like 35 bucks. Three games. Max Payne 1 is like a, not only a great action game, but like psychologically pretty thrilling. I've not played Sekiro. I think that's a Souls-like game, right? something in here that I need to get. Whoa, 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 whoa. Easy. Oh, it's out. It's out. My bad. But yeah, for real, uh, Buster, I hope you're not offended. Sorry, buddy. Oh, you got Max Payne on PS3? I didn't realize they made it for PS3. I guess I have. I think I have Max Payne 2 Sins on PS3. Around the edges. What happened to your owner? I think they got burnt. That's why they're singed around the edges. Oh. Easy now. Anybody over here yet? Looks like maybe one enemy. Nope, that's a bird. That should do it. What the hell are we gonna tell the enforcers? Don't worry about it. We'll say he lost it. Jumped to his death. But you shot him. Details, man. Now I am gonna find his body. God damn it, brother. Why'd you have to do that? Hello, Evan. Mrs. Muss and Murph are doing great. Mrs. Muff is Mrs. Muss is uh, prepping for this weekend's trip. We did some grocery shopping yesterday to make sure we have everything for the campering. So I can't quietly take these guys down, so I'm going to have to go the old-fashioned route. AK-47. Gotcha. Oh, no, he's still alive. Whoa. I played a little bit of Infamous, it was cool. Maybe not completely my style, but I liked it. Some really great controls in Infamous Sun as well. What up, Oda? How you doing, dude? I'm, I'm so excited, I can't wait. Secret tomb nearby. I think I missed a tomb earlier. So I might have to go back and check that out at some point. How's things going, Oda? How are you, buddy? This one seems shaped to be slightly more comfortable. I guess you lay on these flat? Like this? That doesn't really look very comfortable to use the headrest, but what do I know? Alright, so it said there was a tomb nearby. I'm gonna just take a quick peek. Because that might be the entrance to a tomb. Or it might be below. Let's see. Oh, nope. Not going there. Yeah, Infamous was the guy with like superpowers. Hey, what's going on? Need backup. Where's your backup? 
Mr. Norway Gamer 00. That's cool. Mine is Mr. Michael Moss. Get this. This looks like the mission continuing. Oh, 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 oh. Looks like you can maybe get down from here. Ah, maybe... Maybe it's around here somewhere. Good to hear, Oda. Where? Oh, shit. Oh, oh, I got katana. Let me try that again. Looks like it's pointing me over here for some reason. Is there anything I need? I see, I see, probably back here, which looks fine. But I could go down below. Let's see what's down there. I really want to find the tomb. These usually have some good things in them. Okay, there's a ladder up. I don't really need that. Yeah, a band-aid, maybe a splint. Where is this tomb they speak of? Uh, maybe the map will help. Probably not. No, okay. Later, noob. Take care. Thanks for stopping through. Oh, nice. Nice, Oda. You got your mesh. 100% satisfied with mine. I'm sure there's ways that, that I could have more speed or whatever, but for the most part, I've been very, very, very happy with it. What is this? Where are we? That's a water mine. I'm gonna stay away from that. Oh, see something? Nothing. Okay, so this is just an extra place to come and get whatever that was. GPS cache. Alright. I like how it's a mixture of open world and not. This is cool. Ooh, ammo, finally. Good deal. But no... Another GPS cache. I'll take it. I've had that happen before, Evan. Not with Arthur, but I've had that happen before where someone sends me a request and I don't get it. Sometimes PS can be a little bit slow, I think. Alright, I'm not going to look for this too much longer. This has brought me back here. So I'll head upstairs. There, I see those guys chilling. Really wish I had some arrows. Got this new bow. What I'll do is I'll see if I can silence kill this dude. There's one. There's two. Nice. Uh, I think um, Infamous seems really fun. Infamous's son, or second son, whatever it was called. I think that one looked cool. Um, it was a bit of a, too much of a brawler for me, though. Like, I wouldn't stream it, but I would definitely play it. 
Like I enjoyed, I enjoyed the gameplay. It just didn't seem like something that would be very fun to stream. I considered it though. So again, while I've got everybody here, I just want to remind you that my schedule is a little different this week. I'll be streaming today and tomorrow, and then off on the weekend because I'm going camping. Celebrate my birthday. Wish there were some arrows here, but... Oh, is that up there, maybe? Alright. That should do it. What the hell are we gonna tell the enforcers? Don't worry about it. We'll say he lost it. Jumped to his death. But you shot him. Details, man. They aren't ever gonna find his body. God damn it, brother. I need help here! Come on. Alright, they're handled. I think the mountain sign on this might mean this is a this is a Yeah, this must be the tomb. Check the map. Yep, that's the tomb. I should have just stayed here. Hopefully there'll be some arrows in here. See what puzzles this tomb has for me. What you got? Thanks, Jordo, and you have fun in Japan. That sounds like a really good trip. Come on, give me arrows. Salvage. Usually these are enemy free, but at this stage I'm not sure. I'm not sure what to expect. A secret spot. That's oh, like a secret end exit, maybe. Okay. Sadie is a great character, I agree. What a badass. Mr. Strauss, Mr. Strauss. Mr. Strauss. Aw. Does this train go backwards? It's my favorite kind of train. So now we're finding lots of children's toys. I'm assuming that's not good. Hey, Buster, thank you so much for the super chat, man. Far too kind. I appreciate you. Thank you very much. Let's see what she says. Commando rifle. Modify weapon assault rifle to commando rifle? Yes. What's the commando rifle going to look like? Let's see if we can figure out what it is. It's just like a gnarlier version of the AK. That's pretty. Grenade launcher. Oh, I can add frag grenades. S in increase zoom magnification. Press R3 to zoom. Okay, that's kind of cool. Silencer. I can't afford any of these right now, but it's good to know. My other guns are pretty well upgraded, so I'm just going to stay with it. Okay, 
options, go upstairs, or press these buttons. I'm gonna try upstairs first. This was part of the research facility. Were they sent here to investigate the storms? Hmm. Well, might as well. The power's still on. How is that possible? Alright, so we're gonna have a little puzzle to get across this electrocuted water. What is that sound? Doesn't really sound good. Pretty complicated enigma, okay. I like a challenge, so let's see what they got. So we can set this on fire. I don't know what that does yet. I'm guessing it's gonna free this little boat. And then over here, what have we got? Okay, not the one you were thinking of. Why do I feel like I'm gonna have a battle with some pretty badass something or others here because that noise is very freaky and there's shotgun ammunition everywhere oh I think I might need arrows for this okay I got a couple Good deal. Buster, thank you for gifting a membership, and it went to Enigma. Awesome. I don't know what I'm doing here, but I'm just going to keep on trying it out. Huh. Could I run over there, perhaps? That seems extremely sketchy. For now, I'm gonna guess this boat is just, or whatever that is, it's not what I'm looking for. Maybe on the way back? Oh, no, no, no. It is going to be something that I need. Okay, there's a rope across the top. That looks like an exit, perhaps. And this is probably going to kill me, but I'm going to try it. Thank you, George. Oh, death. <laughs> Oops. Take care of the obvious stuff first. Nothing in here. That's already burnt. No, it's not. <laughs> Good use. So somewhere else. So pulling it from here doesn't seem to do much. A good yank comes out of the water. What if I hit this thing twice? No, I'm just gonna waste all my arrows doing this. stairs while that is going down. Okay. I got you. Go, go! Ah. <laughs> Alright, that ain't it. Fuck. 
freeing this thing. Now, what does that get me? Think, 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 think. What can I do here? Oh, maybe from upstairs? I'll try this again. There was a way to look out upstairs. I didn't notice if I could go that route, though. Yeah, nothing. Nothing up here, but let me see if I can get a better view. That's not it. Think, must Think. You must think. So it kind of seems like I should be able to pull myself somewhere using this. And that doesn't exactly appear to be happening right now. Thanks, Alan. I would have got that eventually. Appreciate you. Thanks, guys, but let me cook. Let me cook. This will get me closer. I see if I keep doing it, maybe... Maybe it'll get me where I wanted to go. Appreciate it. I do. Come on over. Yeah, that looks jumpable. Let me cook. Let me cook. I got this. Thank you for the, the idea. It was a good idea. Now I can probably do this. Oops. That should be easy to cross. Thank you. Bam. Teamwork. Yeah, this electricity sound is kind of freaky. Next trick. Got to be a way to make the water safe to cross. So, oh, uh, I got an idea. I got an idea. Let's try and pull the boat. This will be a little bit of a challenge, I think. Evan, sleep well, dude. So if I do this, and then try and catch this, super close, but that's not it. That's probably what I need to do, though. Come on, get it! Catch it! Tricky. Hey, Mrs. Muss. How's work? Pull it. Bam. Booyah. Got it. That's a helpful little raft. I'm seeing seven likes so far. Thank you very much. If you haven't already, don't forget to tickle the like button. A storage room. Artifacts from an ancient tomb. What were they looking for? Got it. Thanks, Arthur. 
And Alan, thank you very much. That worked out in my favor. What do I get here? Done. Dusted. Oh, eight. Awesome. That's everybody, I think. Shipwreck beach relic map. I'll take that. Those are helpful. So that means when you get near something, it'll tell you about it. And now we see this is just quick. That had some goodies in it. I think I got some shotgun shells in there and everything. I heard a rumor that Oda celebrated a birthday or is going to celebrate a birthday soon. So happy birthday, Oda. You don't have to, you know, uh, confirm or deny that. It's up to you. Enjoy it. They pay you. Might as well. Alright. Back to the hunt for whatever is happening here. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Okay. Reach the Endurance Wreck. Right. So I remember there was somebody here. I'm gonna try moving out with my silence pistol as much as I can. Was he gone? He's gone. Handled. If I got that totally wrong, Oda, I apologize. <laughs> okay, I'm early. Dang it. <laughs> I'm like batting a thousand. I said that Buster was like 60 years old earlier. I think because Buster's retired and that's stuck in my mind. But I'm just just doing a great job at keeping up with everybody's age and birthdays here, obviously. Tall grass means nothing to me. The Sun Queen grows old. Soon she will choose her successor. I fear it will be me. I am now her favorite. She dotes on me calls me her precious first daughter. Like a doll, she always keeps me close to her, brushing my hair, dressing me in her favorite clothes. That's it unsettles creepy. me beyond words. Yeah. But more disturbing, she constantly gazes upon my features as if, as if she's looking at her own reflection. Okay, creepy sun queen. Buster's got a new fridge again. You're a summer baby, awesome. Must have been cold that fall. I can pull that down. Damn, can't do that yet. No, I can't pull those down. Okay, all right. I like how it's teasing me that I'm eventually going to get some equipment that'll help me. Cliffside bunker. This ought to be full of enemies. What do you think? Technically, you were 41 when you retired. Oh, the things I would do with the free time. All right, cool. A new camp. They're tearing it apart. Ah, they're scrapping the boat. All right, chop shop going on out there. Let's see if I can upgrade anything. I should be. I got 735 and a skill point. Nice. I didn't see that. So, with the skill points, I'm pretty close to upgrading one of these completely, or at least as completely as I can see. Um, Hunter, I'm about two-thirds. Yeah, I'm going to fully upgrade 
brawler. Press circle to dodge and then... Trophy earned. Clever girl. Good. I was hoping something might happen. Press to match the ring prompt. Okay, so this is just more deadly when I do that special attack. And then gear-wise... I'm gonna go ahead and upgrade... I think I'm gonna put a scope on this thing. I think it'd be helpful to have a scoped weapon. And that'll do it for now. Let's see how that works. Okay, that is helpful. Clever mus. I like the sound of that. Me too, Oda. Glad we have our buster. That movement is a lot like what Drake does too when you're in this position. Where he like turns and puts his arm out to let you know that he's ready. Now why? Is he trying to get down? Nope. Oh, I see. Keep going. You like that? Lots of good inspiration came from this. I'm glad. Because Uncharted games are great. Whoa, huge, huge piece of... Play. Whoa, okay. Had a misfire. That's not good. Map updated, point of interest revealed. Alright, I'm headed into the point. <laughs> says, had I stayed in the army, I'd have three years until retirement. Now I have 156 years. <laughs> Dang it. I think my wife has like 10 years until we get like full benefits and stuff. Basically, she can retire at that point if she wants. I'd like to retire early if I can. let them talk. Yeah, that, that gun was a monster. I can imagine, Buster. Sad time for you and, and difficult time for your family. Glad you pulled through. Okay, I think I have an option for a stealth kill here. Yep. Ooh. Oh, this could be a bit of a shootout. Keep it steady. We're bringing it up. What do you think's going on? All that smoke right now. If there was a problem, they'd call down. But what about the radio? Nothing but static on that. Help me out here! Get down here! Holy crap. That might have been a mistake. I'm rushing. I'm rushing. Probably not a good idea. Deadly kill. Okay, okay, I gotta be more careful next time. Keep it steady, we're bringing it up. What do you think's going on up in the palace? All that smoke rising over the night. If there was a problem, they'd call down. But what about the radio? Nothing but static. Something's going on. Brother, I told you to be silent. Stop this talk.
Yep, stand back. Uh-oh. Whoa, 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 why am I not killing? Oh, I got screwed up in the camera work there. Very many vibes, agreed. Obviously this was quite, oh, okay, all right. Let's bring me back right here. That was worth it. Try a different route. These guys are tough. Killed your friend? Yikes. Still someone creeping. Oh, you? my move where's my moves nope it's not it okay I'm gonna have to mess him up bye whoa finisher perfect all right let me loot this stage make sure I got everybody wasn't my cleanest work but I got through it the game is nice about reloading it into sort of like into a position where you're all right kind of like in some ways in some other ways it can put you in the tough spots Uh, how's the weather, everybody? Good? It's been warm here, like in the low 80s, which has been nice. David, point of interest. And lots of weapons. has been attacked Thanks, by Arthur. unknown assailants. We suspect the Americans have arrived and are attempting to sabotage our operations. Communications have been disrupted across the island and we've sustained heavy losses. Many of our soldiers have simply disappeared. All remaining personnel are proceeding to the ancient monastery to ensure control of the weather phenomenon. We expect to meet heavy resistance en route. Request reinforcements as soon as possible. Okay, so this is like a World War II era message. Ah, uh, the Sun Queen is in your neighborhood. Sun, rain, and wind. And Oda, you're up in the 60s? Nice. It's a great time of year. Things start changing. It feels like a renewal. Also feels like a reward. To quote a movie I love very much. 
want to get upstairs. How do I? I don't know. If this is if this is the right way. Yep. Yeah. Oh. serve a little bit. I see you hiding back there. at your house. That's good, Buster. Better than rain for uh, snow, rather. I can definitely feel the summertime coming back, although I also know that this weekend we're camping, and that's great. We probably will have a little bit of rain on Sunday, but it won't be anything substantial. At least I don't expect it to be. Loot, loot, loot. What's going on? Who's shooting? Take cover. There's an intruder. Yeah, I gotta go with the incendiary. Question is, where are these boys? Not here. Ah, uh, shotgun upgrades coming. Thanks, Alan. I'm looking forward to it. I don't know if you know or not, but I've been working... My wife and I have been working on uh, a 90s camper project for a few years now. And so it's it's really at a point now where it's going pretty well and it, it runs great. has nice, clean, new curtains and stuff. Oh, I see you guys. Ah, uh, he's dead. I saw somebody else there with him, though. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, and I hear your friends. Still playing. Oh. Yes, bring s'mores. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You're done. Finish him. Okay, seems like I'm alone now. Yeah, Arthur, if you could call it in, I could use a clear day. But we'll be Friday and then Sunday and then go home on Monday morning. So there's a really good chance I'll be back to stream on Monday. I expect I will be. Oh, wow. Okay. Trying to hit him with a double tap, you know? Am 
might have been his last moment. Okay. Oh, cool. Alan used to work at a Winnebago shop. This one's called a Four Winds. It's a Ford E350. It's 23 feet long. And it's from 1997. When we bought it, it has a nice low mileage on it. It has a 10-cylinder Triton engine in it. Um, but it did have a very leaky roof. Needed some new plumbing, a new toilet, a bunch of other ran tires, shocks. I mean, it had... It needed work. Um, but I'm that guy. And it, I've put in a lot of both my wife and I have put in a lot of blood and sweat and money into it and finally it's really in a good spot very pleased uh no buster I'll be on tomorrow though to sort of make up for the fact that there's no Friday Saturday yep this perfect for the two of us we have a little dog too and um it's perfect I have no no complaints oh. Hear somebody? Where are you at? Oh. Okay, that's nothing. Oh, 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 oh. Found him. Triple tap. Uh, but it's got like a nice propane fed oven and stove. was awesome. Yeah, tomorrow I'll be back. Maybe, depending on how today goes, either potentially finishing this one, I don't know. I don't know how many more hours are, but it definitely feels like I'm getting close to the end. Or if not, I might just pick something random to play, or maybe just play Red Dead. I don't know. I got options. Maybe do the extra missions for Hitman. It's nice to have options. Over the weekend, I'll try and post some members-only content. It might just be like videos of our camper and campground stuff, but if that would be interesting to you guys, I'm I'm down. What's this? Two hours. And maybe, maybe a third hour if it's like... Especially if it's feeling like end of game, I might tack on some extra time, but at least two hours. That's the plan. I mean, I've put another hour into this. This is hour number 11 in this game. So, we'll see how much further it has. Oh, look at the sun setting. I'm assuming that's a sunset. Alex, in. what kind of trouble have you gotten yourself into? Cool. Yeah, I'll post some stuff in Discord, too. Just for us. Nice, Buster. I failed at my plan for brewing a beer for the May um, get-together that I'm going to, but... Something... Oh, there was something down there. I'm gonna have to go back. Oh, no, no, no. That's not the way to go back. Hang on, I gotta backtrack a little bit. Assuming I can safely go back, which I might not be able to. Hmm. Might not be safe to go back. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I don't think I can safely make it back down there. I guess I could try going through this hole, but this looks kind of crazy. Here we go. Hey, it worked. I saw it over here somewhere. Uh, no, maybe that's where I'm headed. Your fault didn't push you enough to brew. <laughs> I'll take full credit for this one. It's just me not planning very well. And Oda, pretty soon you're heading to your camper to assess damages. Pretty bad damage from a tree falling on it. Oh, it might be the end of it. Oh no, I hope that's not the case. Oh, 
Oh, maybe it's... Oh, it's just right here. Ouch. There it is. Got a little disoriented on where I was looking there. The date reads May J6, which is 1873. One side is worn down, as if it was rubbed repeatedly. Maybe this was a soldier's good luck coin. Maybe. Take it. Piece of candy. Me too. Me too. Monday's the real day off. Friday we'll leave here sometime about the same time I would normally stream. But it'll be nice to have Monday just to chill. Alright, what else can I do here? Pretty close to fully upgrading the shotgun, so I might as well, if I can afford it, go for the wrap stock. And I've got 500 left. Frag grenades, yep. So frag grenades, so these grenades, I guess, just make an explosion. The frag grenades are going to, like, throw a bunch of um, shrapnel, so a bunch of small pieces of metal around. So it'll, they won't be able to hide from it as easily. If, you, if I shoot near them, it's going to do the job. Lars, totally right. Something seriously fucked up okay, is so going on Alex. here. It's a natural phenomenon that causes the weather to go apeshit, a military research base, some kind of sun queen, and a crazy cult. I mean, if I didn't know better, I'd say this is a big put-on. Uh, TV cameras hidden in the trees? <laughs> I mean, you know, I, I got uh, it. scaring the shit out of me. I, I keep cracking jokes to cover it up. Reyes looks ready to kick my ass. I think I need to do something useful before I completely lose it. I wish I could be more like Lara. She just... She blows me away. Not only is she brilliant, but she's also an amazing ass kicker. If she didn't notice me before, she sure as hell won't now. But maybe I can still do something to get her attention. Aww. Oh, Alex has a little crush, so he's trying to do this. He's trying to do this on his own to get Lara's attention. Might be able to salvage it, Oda. I hope you can. But, you know, I, I hear you. Like, if it's too expensive to do that, then it's just not worth it. You can just go find another one. Or find something that... I'm just curious what this would be. Find something that um, needs less work. That's for. Pull it again, maybe. Hmm. Okay. Good night, Alan. Thanks for hanging out. Hopefully, see you tomorrow. If not, next time. Said my man, money pits are all over the place. That is a long zip. Longest zip of the game. Oh.
So I see there's rope tied around that big crane type thing. Seems kind of crazy. Uh, I don't know what to do. <laughs> He's got the extra large can of spinach. Headshot. Gotcha. How you feel now? Keep sticking him with stuff. Talk trash at the wrong time. Okay, he's getting he's getting hit to that. Oh, that that headshot did some. Kill shot. Yeah. Oh. Oh, the humanity. Such a beautiful beast. Why did you have to die? Aha. Rope ascender. New gear acquired. Okay, so this is probably how I pull down stuff. Pull heavy objects wrapped in rope with a rope ascender. Got it. No problem, George. Come when you can, you know? You know how it goes. I appreciate you being here when you can. Don't even trip. I'm gonna look around real quick just to make sure there's nothing here. Oh, uh, I think I know what's about to happen here. So... Alright, and then shoot it down. Oh, 
did the job for me. Let me make sure I'm all loaded up. Find Alex. Alex. Kind of looks like I'm supposed to go up here, but I don't think so. Let's see how it would. Back here again. Back in the ship. Memories. Lara and Teague spent probably weeks on this ship. Uh, there's, I think, Sam and Laura. You look different now. A bit more badass. So much has happened. Aha. Uh -huh. Standing right over something. I suppose on some level, I have Laura to thank for this job. She's always believed in me. The academics at college dismissed filmmaking as nonsense. They just saw me as this ditzy American troublemaker with the camera. But you know what? Most people can use a little trouble in their lives. And deep down, I know Laura just wanted to cut loose sometimes. She just needed a little help unlocking her inner party girl. We had so okay. many awesome adventures together. That insane backpacking trip through Bulgaria. <laughs> I was always dragging her out to clubs. And the hiking trip on the south face of Kilimanjaro. Oh, that All Laura fun. wanted to do was explore ruins. <laughs> but who knew we'd run into so many cute guys? Certainly not Lara. <laughs> I have a feeling this expedition is going to be one for the books. Lara with her notebook, me with my camera, another crazy adventure. Yeah, you kind of understated it, Sam. This is one adventure neither of us will want to remember. Yeah. Let's see what's items of interest. So this way. So the ship's broken in half. He burned so bad he went right through the wall. Okay, I'll go back to silence pistol for a minute. Who are you talking to? Oh, I see. Somebody sees me from down there. Headshot. Huge, huge long distance headshot. That was cool. I wonder if I could have just killed him by going down the, the zip line. I think you can. You can't shoot while you're on the zip line, but I think you can use your like your, your kick at the end. Mm, that does not look safe. It's the only way. No weapons? Yeah, there we go. Are you in here? I mean, I think you could use an extinguisher as a weapon. Done in a hit, man, so it's a thing. Saving your ass. I've been down in here. It doesn't look good. No. Damn it. The door's blocked. Just hold on. I'm going to get you 
This new tool gives me a little extra torque. Just what I need. Just wait. Just wait, buddy. I'm coming. I'm coming for you. Oh, uh, right in the middle, huh? doing here? I'm trying to save you, dummy. I see the ceiling, but I don't understand. What am I supposed to do here, dude? If I climb up here, it's nothing. Man. Can I get it? Uh, almost. Alright, that's a start. Thankfully no enemies here right now, so I can just kind of Yeah, this this will this is it. This is not it. there's like a track up top so if I could get it over here again then maybe that would help me but I don't see a way that I can do that I can't just hook it on the side that doesn't work I don't think I can get onto this side oh yeah there we go oh there it there it Poor guy.
that. I'll try doing one more of it. Alright, and this one's blocked off. Okay, okay. I got it. I got it. Wasting a bunch of arrows shooting accidentally. And now we should just be able to ride it over. I think I got this. Just yet. One more. There we go. Clever girl. You didn't, you know. Kick it. Okay. Got it. Alright, now I should be able to move this thing back from whence. Actually, I'm probably just... Alex! Alex! Oh god, I've got to get in there. Don't go to sleep. Sleep's bad. Alex! I'll have you after that soon. Right. Thank you, you Arthur Morgan. One push. Missing recover raises tools. All right, that's up next. Alex, you knucklehead, with your escape button. Finally, I sure. you. Let's get you out of here. Oh, sorry, sorry. Uh, well, it looks like my dance career is over. <laughs> This for a Phillips head and a crescent wrench. You could have done better than that, Laura. This guy's gonna die. At least give him some lips. A little selfish with the kiss. Alex! Oh yeah. Whoa! Cool. Oh, the longest zip line ever. That was so sick. Archer uh, glove that she's wearing. That's cool. Big boy out here again. Oh, gonna get the zip line out of here like that. That's cool that you can use the zip line situation this way. Uh, hang on, I gotta take some ammo. The stuff just got real. Zip. 
brings a whole new meaning to the word zip line. this break on through zip to zip beast mode okay so it's uncovering a new scene where I assume we're running into some new baddies old logbooks my favorite things logbooks of excavation has at last yielded new information concerning the weather patterns gripping this island. <laughs> the tomb of an important general dating from the Kamakura period was discovered in our coastal dig site. This discovery is the missing piece of the puzzle. It will allow us to finally gain control of the storms. Sounds profitable. They found something in the caves. So now I need to go to probably another tomb that I need to go check out. Ancient ruins in the old base. Control over the storms. I need answers. I need answers too. Like, who are we? Where do we come from? And where are we going? Who made us? Uh-huh, now I can use this thing to like stuff down that I couldn't pull down previously. Dang. Nice jump. Give me some salvage and I think there's a collectible or something. In. Yeah. I feel like I'm gonna get jumped on the way out of this area. This is a Tempo Suho. Hard to read the date, but Japan made thousands me? of these in the mid 1800s. Cool. In Japan, did they carry their money on a string or something? Why did they have a hole in it? I just got a notification that you're playing The Sims. Is that you? I've never played The Sims before. How are they? Okay, that's where I came in. Goodbye, boat. I love you. It's over. A little bit of something something over here. One skill point. Nice. Portuguese minted these in the 16th century for their colony in Malacca, Malaysia. This must have come from one Portuguese, of the old galleon racks. Portuguese tin coin. I saw something hiding back here too. Yep. Cliffside bunker complete map found. View reward locations. Sweet. Okay. Cool. I wouldn't judge you for it. I mean, I've heard they're great games. I just haven't played them. Maybe I played The Sims like a million years ago, but not recently. Yeah, 
And yes, I stock your notifications. That's what friends are for. Friends don't let friends play bad games, so I'm always watching your back. And there's a GPS cache. Whoa. That was really close. You love The Sims? Cool. I've never played one. I mean, not any of the modern ones. They look cool, though. I see them often enough, like people doing videos on them and stuff like that. You played one? Hey! Thank you so much, Arthur. Happy birthday, Michael. You are amazing. Keep it always backwards. Outlaws for life. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. Thanks for the super chat and thank you for being my moderator and my friend. That's great. Oh, I think I played the original Sims too. They must have. The original Sims also. I'm thinking it must have been on. I don't know. Maybe PC? You're the best. Thank you so much, Arthur. I'm gonna go with, um... I'm pretty brutal with a shotgun, so I'm gonna master the shotgun. Oh, okay. Tap, press triangle to finish stun enemies with the shotgun. That made my day. Thank you. You and Buster, thank you so much for the super chats and the gifted memberships and stuff today. It does not ever go unnoticed. Yeah, that's, that's insane, right? Does not go unnoticed. Yeah. So I wonder what we're going to do here because Lara now knows... Oh, look at the gun in her, her pocket with the... Or in her holster with the sounds are on it. It's like half her leg. So I think Laura knows now we need to go to this tomb or whatever. And all along the way, I get to figure out what the hell is behind these doors finally. Stuff. And a fast way out. thing. <laughs> oh, oh no. <laughs> have I heard of A Way Out? I have heard of it. I don't know much about it. But that sounds fun. I do like co-ops. Shot. I didn't even think I was going to hit. Let's see what they're hiding over here. 
that's anything important. Maybe a fast way down? It's the fastest way down. Other than jumping. Yeah, I think it's this way, because over here, there's no safe. Cutscene. I didn't do that. She is capable. Sometimes it does ask me to do that kind of stuff. What's this? I thought she was going to give it to the warthog. Here is tools. Learn to use them. Laura! When we heard the explosion, we thought... On the ship. Seems anyone caught with you has a pretty low survival rate. Reyes! Better keep your distance, then. Let's just eat, okay? <laughs> Better keep your distance, Those bastards then, Reyes. Fly, but it doesn't mean they're gonna stay that way. If I'm going to die in this place, I'm not gonna do it hungry. Fair enough. Save a man's stomach. Save his soul. Finally, a little positivity. Once Reyes finishes the boat, we'll be back to civilization in no time. And what a tale we'll have to tell. A tale? I hope we never hear Himiko's name again. We could take the boat out at high tide. No, we can't. Don't start that bullshit again, Lara. Lara isn't the only one who Don't thinks we're trapped. Don't come after me with that BS. Matthias may be insane. He was certain about it. And he's still alive. His eyes. Yeah. He thinks resurrecting Himiko is the key to getting off this island. God, it sounds crazy. But this whole place is crazy. These storms are not natural. We have to face that. She's right. When that storm hit the Endurance, I felt it. Something dark, something alive. This place is cursed. Where are you going? There are ruins beneath that old base in the cliffs. Something in there led them to believe they could control the storms. I've got to find out what they discovered. Let's do that. Once we're ready to leave, we're leaving. Whether you're back or not. I won't leave without you. Reyes is like, we're leaving you. Everyone else is like, don't listen to Reyes. Search. Alright, I'm gonna see if they're on the map now that I have a map. Alright, there is a tomb. I think I already did this one, but let, let me go check it out. Uh, nope. No, I haven't. So I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna do this turn. Yeah, because this is the place I couldn't open the door before. So might as well do this, try and upgrade a little bit. Maybe it'll give me something good. aspect of this game too. It's cool. It's so much more like I think it has so much more flair than a flashlight. Any goodies? Treasure hunting. That's my middle name. Tent. 
Temple of Handmaidens. Ah, there's the little. One month. It is real good. Going to get to the ritual tree really, really good. We need to fix that boat. I don't know how I'm going to convince the others to take it inland rather than off this island, but I have to find a way. Reyes won't be easy. She wants to get back to her daughter, and she's in pain over Roth. We all are. So we've lost three so I far. I don't know exactly why Matthias doesn't matter. She's back with us now. She's safe. I'm gonna go back to look at the aviatrix. Because I think it looks kind of reminds me of like um, uh, Indiana Jones a little bit. So it works. Okay, it's got arrows. Let's take a quick look around. Uh, I'm sure it is one month. I don't know. I'm playing it on PlayStation 4, but it, I'm sure it is. This game has been around since like 2013, and this is the definitive edition, so you want to look for that. Tomb Raider definitive edition is what you want. All right, so that's this is not it. Well, I don't think this is it. That doesn't look like something I can hang on, but nope. Nope. So I've got. What is this all about? So here at the start, we've got this wheel. Okay, so that let that through onto the other side, which turns the crank. Which is going to give me. I'm going to have to jump, run up here and jump across. Just narrowly make it. And it should. Oh, and then I'm going to have to catch this one. Got you. I got you. Oh yeah, yeah, if you could get a physical copy, I think you'd do real well. Okay, kick around, hit it, no! Nope. This is cool, I like the floating element here of this, this thing floating around. But the pace of the game has been really, really consistent. One Mon, graphics are good. It was originally a PS3 game. Thank you, One Mon. Appreciate you, dude. Hope everything is good where you're at. There we go. Oof. Just barely. Yeah. Just barely. That was nice. See, that was a cool timed acrobatic puzzle. I like this kind of thing, as you know. They must use this place to store food. Yeah, storing some food. Okay. It's underground, so I guess it would stay cold, like a lager. <laughs> Give me something good. The subtitles are wrong. Tomb Raided. Temple of the Handmaid is complete. Three out of three handgun parts. Oh, awesome. Time to go upgrade the handgun. Shipwreck Beach GPS cache. New reward locations. I'm sure I've gotten most of them. I don't quite know how to read. Oh, I see. These are GPS caches. So there's one here. There's another one over by the boat. I missed one. I miss a lot. Not going for that today. 
Not this playthrough, maybe on my free time. I looked at some of the, the, the platinum options for this and you can't. There's, there's no way. There's no way to platinum. There's too many online requirements. Uh, Magnum Pistol. I. Sino, thank you very much, dude. And a happy Wednesday to you. Let's take a look at that thing. What's the Magnum look like? I'm, I've been happy with this. 1911 that I've had, but... Oh. Okay, so it's still 1911 shape, maybe more like a SIG. A little bit. And can I fully upgrade it? Well, I can at least increase the magazine capacity. It's the least I can do. some homemade lasagna for dinner tonight. Kind of excited about that. I haven't done it in a long time, but I'm ready. Didn't have school today and don't have school tomorrow. Damn, can't beat that. I'm gonna work on my... S um, on my, I just saw your chat, Arthur. <laughs> I'm gonna work on my screenshot real quick. I'll bring it on screen shortly. Um, but since we've got another sort of wave of people here, just so you know, I'm not streaming Friday and Saturday. I'm going away for my birthday to do a camper trip, but I will be here tomorrow, normal time. Well, 3 p.m. I don't usually stream Thursdays, but you know what I'm saying. I'll be here tomorrow at the normal time instead of Friday. And then I'll be back Monday. Should be good. Uh, let's get some options up here. So I have a picture from last stream of... Where are you at? I think I do. I thought I had one that was called New Bow. Yeah, so I have one that's a new bow. I'll bring this on screen so you can see it in just a second. And then I have one that I just took, which I called Tomb Tomb, because Tomb is the, the pretext that I use for Tomb Raider games. So this one I like. It's kind of cool. I like this red light right here. I definitely like the statues up here. So let's, let me see what I can do. As always, pump up the saturation. It's not a huge change, but YouTube does dull pictures. And then of course we need more brightness and contrast, make everything snap a little bit more. And then finally shadows and highlights brings out colors and lights where you normally wouldn't see them. See like that looks pretty cool. Although she is a little bit dark in this scene. And I wish there's, there might be a way that I can help that. In this one, I just noticed there's a, a halo around her, which is kind of neat. And the halo cutting across. This is a pretty cool picture. Maybe I'm not super compelled by it, but I'm gonna use one of these. I'm gonna see which one I like better. I forgot to take off eight pixels on this side. Lion, hey, how you doing? Good day to you. And eight pixels on this one. I wonder if there's some way I can brighten her up without it looking. Like if I can put some sort of... Hmm. I may try something I've not tried before. Like some way to bring her... She's kind of intricate though. Maybe. Maybe. I don't know. Same thing here. I'm going to boost the saturation. I probably don't, oops, I probably don't need to do as much because it's a very bright picture. This one. And brightness and contrast should help mm, maybe a little too much. Yeah, I don't think, I, I don't think this one needs it. She's a little blurry here. But we'll see. I'll see what happens. 
What am I going to do with you? I'm great, Lion. Just having a good time. I'm going to try something crazy here. This might not work, but I'm going to try something. going to get wild with isolating her. This might look terrible, but we're friends, so. I'm going to forget about the strings because that's too difficult. If it looks terrible, don't judge me. I'm just trying something new. I'm not a graphic designer. All of this I do based on things I've learned over the past few years of streaming. And I also try and do them kind of quick and dirty so that it just gets done. I'm just going to roughly guess where her hair is at. And go underneath here. The bow is huge. I went to um, like a hunting and outdoors shop this weekend. Again, it's new in town, so I wanted to see it and check it out with less people. Oh, crap. Uh, nope, nope. How do I undo these? I'm just going to go right back up here. Nope. What button combination do I use here? There we go. Learning something. Learning something right now. Learning it live. Forget it. We're doing it live. I guess you can move all of these individually. That's kind of cool. I thought that was part of her like outfit, but it's not. It's the background. Oh, this is kind of painful. Won't make it. Won't make this mistake again. But if I do, now I know. It's getting a little confusing. Not gonna lie. Okay, now you come over here, go all the way to here, and up like this. I'm going to Photoshop her. Yes. I'm going to try and make it look better. Now, I don't quite understand why this side did this. Was I just not paying attention and doing the wrong thing, or did I move this whole thing? Oh. It like straightened it out. All right, I gotta, hang on, hang on, hang on. I shouldn't have clicked so many times, but it, the more but more little dots you put in, I think the better off it looks, it's more detailed. It's kind of magic to me. I don't quite know why it put this wider rim around certain parts of her, but We'll see. And over here, too, I see that it did it. Maybe it was trying to be smart. Maybe. All right. So that looks pretty good, right? Oh, it did move, didn't it? Crap cakes. It moved. That's the problem. All right, let me just really quickly fix this up. 
Yeah, I said it. Crap cakes. Cakes made of crap. Some of it I don't really care about, like the fact that it moved around her head a little bit, but these parts need to be pretty crisp. Ah, maybe that's too far off for hair, though. Ooh, magic. All right, first things first, I'm going to cut and then go into paste in place, which hopefully will make a new layer. It does. And now let me try something. Unglue. Hydrogen cars. That's pretty interesting. Oh, I shifted the image. Oh. Uh, I know what I did. That's what I did. I hit uh, undo, and it undo undid my eight pixel movement here. That's why. That's fixed. Good eye, my man. Okay, so first on this layer, let me see if I can make her brighter without it looking crazy. Okay, we're kind of cooking with gas here now. That looks, I mean, look. She definitely stands out more. I have two ideas. So what happens if I do brightness and contrast? That picks her up a little bit. And then shadow highlights. All right, that brings her out. I'm going to do something that I don't think is going to look great, but I'm going to try it. I don't know. Why not? We're all friends. I'm going to try and put like a light drop shadow around her. This might look really crazy. <laughs> Hey, that actually worked out kind of the way I wanted it to, except for I'd rather it look like this and be barely there and grow radius and blur radius go up. All right, stay with me. I know it looks really weird. Let's take grow radius, blur off, grow radius up. Why are you not, why are you not doing this? So I have to have blur radius? No, that's wrong. Something is holding it. There we go. I'm, I'm just messing around with something right now, but that is actually kind of cool. She looks like a sticker. Just wanted to stand out a little bit, you know? Maybe some red? No, that ain't it. And then less opacity. Opacity? No, that's not it. It's white. A little more grow radius. And then almost no opacity. I'm not going to use this, but this looks awesome. She really looks like a sticker. Am I right? It looks like a sticker. Like the kind of sticker that you'd get where the edges are the like white outline like that. Especially with the opacity way up. I'm going to keep this as a... Um, I'm going to duplicate this layer and just keep it and hide it. Uh, all right, so duplicate the layer, then repeat drop shadow, and just hide this one. It looks neat, right? I'll turn it on after I get the, the logo and stuff in place. We'll see. I kind of want it to look like she's looking up at the logo, even though it's going to take some of that out, but we'll see. Looks like your wife. 
All right, and I'll go and grab just from any of these. I didn't use this one, even though it is a cool picture. And first I'm gonna use paste in place uh, to a new layer. It actually doesn't look bad. You can't really see the, the things in the background though, so I'm gonna drop it down a little when the time comes. And I'm gonna do this. Now here's a trick that I'm gonna do that may help somebody. Paste in place. Oops, I grabbed the wrong layer. I'm gonna pull first play and then paste it into place. And because I want this to be the same, on the same location of, of the logo in every shot, I'm actually gonna merge these two layers together. So I'm gonna merge down because I don't really plan on changing that layout. And now I can just move this and they will move together. So maybe I can move it down here and have her bow kind of cutting into it. And I might do one more, um, one more sweep of trying to brighten this image up because it's a little dark. And here I'm just gonna find something that's about half the size. And delete, same thing. The key for me is not to go over the outside lines so that when I turn this all the way back up, it actually looks like it's sitting in front of it. And that worked perfectly. Now, I'm going to try and brighten up the background again. And I'm going to try and brighten up her again. Oops. Oops. What do you think? Is it pretty? Should I try and change it? Should I add the sticker layer? Sticker layer doesn't really work. Maybe it does. Hang on. Hide you. It's weird. That, oh, the sticker layer is not coming through because on this one, uh, No, I'm, I'm kind of messing up. Do you like the sticker layer? I, I can fix it so that you can see all these sticker things. Or do you like non-sticker? I think she actually kind of stands out a little bit with the sticker layer. And it is kind of a unique look. I don't know. What do you think? I got a minute or two to think on this because I have nowhere to go right now. So I guess while I'm thinking on it, I'll let you look at it. I'm going to add... I do any kind of drop shadow? No, no drop shadow needed here. Maybe on first play? Yeah, I did. Okay, I'll, I'll do a drop shadow without the sticker. Okay, cool. Sticker's cool. I learned something, so I'll take that. You know, that's something that, no. April 8th. No sticker. And it does look like I missed top of her head here, I think. Um, no, I guess it was just the sticker. Does look like she's looking up at the words, which I like. I'm going to try going one layer higher on brightness. Just keep going and see what happens. Good point, Oda. It's not something I've done before. Maybe I'll try and fit it in sometime. She's not looking washed out yet. And it's kind of cool that I can, like, I did pretty good cutting her out. Like, that was just quick and easy. It would be fun to make, like, a whole scene with multiple people, like, stickers. I think that would be fun. It would be a lot of work, but. I kind of wish I could darken this area up a little bit, which I think I'm going to do, just to try something. So I'm going to. Add a layer mask, which is just a layer that sticks in front of it. And then I'm going to add another layer. We've done this before. 
together. Put it behind everything, paint it black, and then up here use the white to black gradient. Oh, that's the wrong way. Ooh, wait a second. Wait a second. I've got it set to like vignette because I was using this for something else. This is way too much, but. Uh, let me turn that off. Radial, I usually use linear so that it's from one side only, and then I can kind of, uh, that's not what I want. Make her necklace shiny, that's a good idea. I'm sure I could do that. I wanna darken this corner without really, cause this is where the duration is gonna go and it doesn't matter to me. It's not what people's eyes go to necessarily but I'll try that that's I, li I like that challenge so what I would do probably one of the easiest ways to do that would be to circle select the necklace and then there's probably a couple of ways I could do this That's not it. Um, did I select too small of a spot? I think I did. Sparkle. I wonder what... Oh, I see. It's sparkling is going to take anything that's white. So let me try something here. This might look like absolute trash, but I'm going to try it. Oh, what am I doing? It's this one. That's why none of that stuff is working. And then highlight just this part. Maybe run sparkle. Will this work? No. <laughs> Hang on. <laughs> uh... Let's try sparkle again. I think it's just turned up way too high. Getting there. weird how it's showing the preview that doesn't doesn't really help me at all <laughs> this is fun I like that idea though I don't get what's going on with the sparkle but uh getting there that's really close so I think I just need to add some flare intensity and some spike length. That's way too much. No, maybe not. What about instead of sparkling, what if I put a lens flare right there?
There we go. There we go. I see it. Can I make it bigger? Brighter? Is there anything more I can do here? You see it? There's like two of them. Like two little lens flares that are coming off from that, but they're not very bright. That's not it either. Whoa. Uh, let's make it white. And this looks like it might be a little... <laughs> not what I was looking for. It's really cool. Ah, uh, yeah, I could do that. With some yellow. No one is going to notice this, but it's fine. We will know it's here. This is actually pretty cool. I've never tried this before. Thank you for the inspiration. Can I move you? No, I can. And I don't know why the color is like this. If I do white and put it now. This is pretty cool. Good idea, Buster. I technically should make the circle bigger. I'm getting there. Thank you, Enigma. <laughs> I'm learning stuff every day. Every single day I learn something new. And I love it. It's so fun. Bring the radius back down. And number of spokes. What if I crank that? Whoa, look at that. Huh. It's pretty cool what you can do. But I don't need this many spokes. You need like... Shrink the radius a little smaller. Move it over. And up. I wish I could make it a little bit brighter without making the spokes go out so far. What does random hue do? It looks pretty cool. Holy crap. Look at that. All right, so I got a little work to do on the edge. So it can't go out quite this far, but I think I can fix that. Oh, I know why. It's because it should have been darker. And I'm on the wrong spot. Champagne supernova. Is it always going to go all the way out to the edge? <laughs> I 
This random hue. Or there was a way I could get it to like feather. Uh This is really kind of fascinating though. I have one more idea. I know this is going to come out sort of like what I had before. But I think I can do something here, like blur. Nope. Nope. That's not it. I'm impressed. All right, it doesn't really matter that there's a circle around it. Because from a thumbnail perspective, in fact, I might even be able to do this. How about dodge? Sorry, burn. Get some that's fine so burn kind of darkens up the color a little bit or it should oops that's making her look bruised might not be affecting the sparkle though let me try something out here All right, so that fixes that lapel. You can still get the, the same feel from it. Just want to kind of maybe smudge. I'll take away this circle shape a little bit. That didn't look right. I think that's it. I think it's done. Yep. Bang. Thumbnail's done. I'm going to save that so I don't lose all my precious work. This might be, even though, you know, it's funny because people just flip right by these and don't think about it. This might be one of the more intricate ones because I put so many layers in, right? Like this extra layer to make her bounce. Like she, she definitely pops a lot more with the color here and then obviously the logo and making the the compound bow cut through that and i like the the way that this is shadow this was kind of taking a lot of my attention away i considered like just trying to darken this whole lineup which i'll try just for fun let's try dodge on this whole thing Oops. It's fine. Random hue. All right, I'm saving this, and that's done. All right, uh, that's going to do it for today. We'll continue celebrating my birthday week tomorrow with more Tomb Raider. I got a really strange feeling, Enigma, you can correct me if I'm wrong, but I got the feeling that this is probably going to be one of the last chapters. Um, I think I basically just have to leave this. It's probably saved already, but I'm going to run out. But anyway, I hope you all have a great night and um, enjoy your rest. Thanks for staying with me a little later than usual. It is that time. I want to thank my moderators, Oda, uh, Arthur Morgan, and Mrs. Musk for stopping in and helping today. 
really appreciate everybody's help every day. It is hugely helpful for me. Thank you, dude. Uh, what do I do here? Have I gone and got myself trapped? Ah, there we go. <clears throat> Hell yeah. Yeah, this is really fun. Let me get outside real quick. And then I'll, I'll, I'll do what I need to do. But again, reminder, tomorrow I'll be back. Uh, same time. Tomorrow afternoon. I'm having a damn good time. Thanks again, Enigma, for recommending the game. I'll see y'all real soon. Take care of yourselves. Be good. Until tomorrow. Peace, love, and burritos.